Yeah, it was all right. It was just like the flu. So a couple of days, and I was I was okay to come back, but I had to wait seven days. Did you watch the Sharks game from home? Yes, it, 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 it's it's so hard to try to do coaching from home. It, uh, it's definitely not the same, and it, uh, yeah, it was frustrating. Do you feel like the last few weeks with a few wins, the coaching guys have been moving up a couple of years now? Well, I, I'm getting to know the players a bit better, and, and the staff, obviously. And, um, yeah, so I'm feeling more comfortable, and you know, I'm, 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 uh, I'm not satisfied. But, but um, yeah, I think the, the team's improving. South Sydney had big tests, two very good tackle teams coming up against one another. Who's definitely well, I, I'm expecting them to, to do what they've been doing, and they, they seem to strip numbers from the opposition all the time. They, they roll forward. They, uh, they've got plenty of momentum with their big forwards. So. It's going to be a challenge for us to, to stop them and, uh, and limit their opportunities. And we've, we've got a plan in place, hopefully it works out. He's, yeah, he's awesome. With, with him with Cody Walker and uh, Elias there, and, and then uh, I'm expecting Damon Cook to back up. And well, there's, just, there's so many threats in that team. It's, 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 uh, it's going to be a tough one. I think it'll be one of our biggest challenges I've been in. I haven't spoken to Matt, so I'll, I'll just see how he is, and you know, I'll just get, I'll get a feel for that. And yeah, it, it was a pretty torrid, torrid game, and yeah, it, I'll see how it's played out. Um, both of them probably could do with some boxing lessons. I, I, I thought, but, um, yeah, they, they were intense, and yeah, it was just the, the spur of the moment. And, um, yeah, so, it's, it's, a, it's awesome to watch, but you know, I would hate to be there. Do you think it's fair that they, you know, they're both the same fine, but there's clearly a copy of you on the head more than the gay guy? Well, I think, I think both their intentions was, was to defend themselves, maybe. Um, I, think, I think alternatively there, there probably could have been some other action taken on, on other people, but yeah. Yeah, he did. He did cop the the, um, the rough end of the pineapple there. I thought. Were they lucky to not get suspended? Do you reckon? Um, yeah, oh, I think so. It's um, yeah, it's just. I think the the ten minutes in the bin, I think, took took the heat out of that moment, and uh, that was that was sufficient. Is it all part of the Origin Arena? That kind of desire. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's it, it's intense, isn't it? It's great to watch, and it's a, a good spectacle, and you wouldn't want it to change. Um, um, Aaron Shop out this week with COVID as well. How's he going? Yeah, he, he's okay. He's, he's feeling a bit where um, like a little bit under the weather two days ago, but I, I think he's improved. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, hopefully, he'll be right in seven days or five days, whatever's left. Where did he get up from? Is it at the club or during the bye Yeah, I, honestly, I don't know. It's it, it's a bit of a mystery, isn't it? But everyone else is feeling okay. Everyone, everyone's fine, yeah. yeah. Well, there's a bit of COVID around. Like, if yourself, you just recovered because of him, you're better, and Aaron now out. Is COVID, do you think, going to be now the new way a real uh, concern for clubs in this winter period? Well, if they're going to police it like this, yeah, it, it is a concern. And if, if they treat it like it's a, like it is and you have to have seven days in quarantine, it, 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 it's going to affect every team. Uh, it, that's if it continues like it is. So, you know, we've got no idea what's what's going to happen. Mm. Do you have um, a specific game plan to when you bring in um, Casey in his place? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, Casey's trained there um, just in the no contact. So we, we we need to have a look at Casey today. So his protocols are that he can do contact today. So we'll just see how he goes today, and you know, we'll just we'll take it from there. Just so it's still maybe at the moment for the weekend? Uh, yeah, yeah, so we'll have, we'll have to test that today. Yeah. Just on the COVID, do you think this is the right way to be going about? Could we see teams sort of getting wiped out, teams getting players out if we're doing a seven-hour selection? Well, potentially if, 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 there, if there is a, a, a spat in a, in a team, and I don't think the teams have, have got the resource if there are sort of seven, eight, nine, in, nine um bouts of COVID in any one week, it, your resources are really, really tested. So if, if you've got 
injuries, which we have got, it's, it's going to, it certainly would test us to the wire. And, um, teams that haven't got injuries probably have got the backup. Cutting on to yourself and each time players to be extra careful now about this next one. Yeah, we, we, we'll make that point again today and, and just about being wary of, of, of where you socialise and you, you can't tell people what to do. But, but you just just in this environment, we, it's, it's just the way the rules are and, and we have to be cautious. You said you're not satisfied with the team at the moment. Do you see yourself maybe taking this team into next season? Have there been any developments there? Uh, not at all. I haven't discussed it with anyone yet. So not, not at this stage. You've said how uh, dominating the Rabbitohs are looking. Do you feel the team is ready to take that on? How confident are you? Uh, I'm, I'm confident we can we can put up a fight, and if we do certain things right and and really limit limit their their meterage and and uh, you know, limit their opportunities, we we can we can um, win the game. That's it, it's a tough ask, and I don't think it's beyond our players. What do you think the game's going to turn on? Well, I think uh, I think it'll be it'll be defensively based. Like if our defence is right, then we'll um, we'll put ourselves in with a chance. If if our defence is not not up to standard, you know, they, it, it could be anything for them because they've, they've got so much strike and 